While searching for recipes on Glazy, you may have noticed this chart in the top left-hand corner of the screen. This is a silica alumina chart. Overlaid on top of this chart is a stull chart. The stull chart was created by R.T. Stull in 1912, and it shows regions of glazes on top of the silica alumina grid. These regions are the bright region in the middle, the semi-matte region, the matte region, the unfused and devitrified regions, as well as the crazed region. Glazes that fall within the devitrified and unfused region are immature or not fully melted. Glazes that fall within this crazed region are possibly crazed. Glazes that fall within the bright region are glossy and bright, the semi-matte region contains glazes that are satin or matte, and the matte region contains matte glazes. In Glazy, the stall chart has been simplified just to show the regions. The unshaded middle region is the bright region. Above and to the left of that is the semi-matte region, and next is the matte region. This shaded area here is the crazed region. When looking at this chart on Glazy, we can expand the map by clicking this button. As you browse Glazy, you will notice that most of the recipes fall within the bright region, while semi-matte and matte glazes fall within this area. The stall chart is a very good indication of what the glaze type will be, either matte, semi-matte, or glossy. In general, low fire glazes will be located lower in silica and alumina, while mid fire glazes will be located in the middle of this region, while high fire glazes will be located in the upper reaches of this region.